Today's screencast will show you some text-to-speech options for your PC. There are so many great uses of your computer's text-to-speech feature. For students, a wonderful use is for proofreading essays. Proofing is so much easier and so much more effective when a student can follow along the text that is, as it is read aloud. Of course, this feature is great for those with vision impairment as well as anyone who struggles with reading. If you use a PC, the text-to-speech option I recommend is Google Speak. First, you'll need to download the free internet browser Chrome. This is a free, safe download. In fact, it's my favorite browser that I use for most of my internet work. I keep it down in the dock here, right next to Firefox. Just go to chrome.google.com to get your free download. Chrome.google.com once you have Chrome, you'll need to get the Chrome, go to the Chrome Web Store to get your free copy of Google Speak. So now go to chrome.google.com slash web store. So let's go over there right now. Chrome.google.com slash web store will get you to this page. In the search field right here, we're going to type Chrome Speak. And then I'll get a list with Chrome right here, Chrome Speak right here at the top. So that's what we're going to get. Since I already have it on my computer, it's not giving me the option to add it. Rather, it's giving me the option to rate it. But you will get a blue um, box like this one on this next app, and it says Add to Chrome. So click on that, and it'll just take a few minutes for it to add it to your Chrome browser. You'll be able to, you'll know that your um, download is complete because a little pair of headphones like this right here will appear on your um, Chrome browser bar. Now when you want Chrome to read something on the internet simply highlight the text and right click to get the drop down menu that includes the choice to read the selected text. So let's go to this poem, The Raven, and if I highlight this little section here, and right click, I get a little pop up menu, and one of my choices is read the selected text. Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered, weak and weary, over many a quaint and curious volume of forgotten lore, while I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a tapping, as of someone gently rapping, rapping at my chamber door. Tis some visitor, I muttered, tapping at my chamber door. Only this and nothing more. So there you go. Um, your computer reading the Raven out loud to you. Proofreading an essay isn't as easy as it is with a Mac, but you can still do it. Um, so you highlight, well, first of all, let's bring up um, the little pop up window here. If I click on the, the Google Chrome speakers, I get a little pop up window that gives me some options. There's a little field here to, to um, where you can enter some text to read out loud. So I'm going to go over to an essay here from one of my students from years ago. And I can highlight this paragraph, copy it, and paste it into the field here. And then I can tell it. Click on the speak button. Two of the spectacular sites in Massachusetts are either hiking up the 3,491 feet of Mount Greylock or in a raft traveling the 66 miles across the Massachusetts Connecticut River Byway. Mount Greylock is the highest point in Massachusetts overlooking the Berkshire Hills. Once reaching the sun. So you can see that if I had that going on in the background while I also had the paragraph displayed, I could follow along while it read out loud to me. So there you have it. Your computer reads out loud to you.